You know, as the garden is, is kind of finishing up, we're getting the final harvest, we're getting the potatoes out, we're harvesting the squash, we've had a hard frost, it's time to prep the garden for next year. You know, it's enjoyable, it's a great time out in the garden, but when it's over, yeah, it's, it's time to take a break. So I like to put as much organic matter out there as possible. So when you're prepping your garden for fall, remember variety is the key. We want a variety of a whole bunch of different things. We don't want a lot of any one thing. So don't do four inches of steer compost and think your garden is going to be amazing next year. Don't do four inches of compost from the landfill and thinking your garden is going to be amazing. We need a variety of different materials. So we want, you know, inch of leaves, uh, half inch of grass clippings, some compost from the landfill, some steer compost from the dairy down the street. We're going to use a bunch of different types of materials, wood shaving, sawdust. We need a variety of materials to be really successful with it. And then we're going to add some nitrogen to it. So ammonium sulfate, straight nitrogen, it's 21% nitrogen. We need that nitrogen to help break that material down. So a lot of organic matter, it's very high in carbon. We need a lot of nitrogen to get that to break down. And we need a bunch of microbes and microorganisms to speed up that decomposition. The humic is full of microbes, microorganisms, minerals, micronutrients, all kinds of building blocks of life, but it'll help break that compost down and uh, turn that into soil. So if we add our microbes and microorganisms that do the decomposition process, add some nitrogen in there to help speed up that process. And then if you're experiencing a lot of heavy clay soils, a uh, soil conditioner like this Utilite, this is a uh, wonderful naturally occurring material. It looks kind of like cat litter, but it absorbs and holds moisture like crazy. It's volcanic rock, and so it's going to be a permanent addition to your garden where the compost is going to break down over time. This is going to stay out there consistently, and it's going to improve your soil. It's going to help with drainage. It's going to keep the clay from binding up and sticking together, turning into big clods. The Utilite soil conditioner, along with all that organic matter, some nitrogen, humic, till it all in and uh, you'll have an amazing soil combination for next year. So something we want to do every single year is amend our soil and if we do the right combination we'll have a really successful garden for next year.